Now, ladies and gentlemen, uh, earlier this week, <coughs> astronomers discovered a one-mile-wide asteroid in space. I don't know if you heard about this, but it's been in all the papers. They say it could hit Earth in 2019, wiping out one-quarter of the Earth's population. Now, this is a huge story. It's got a lot of people kind of freaked out, so we thought we should bring in an expert to explain the situation. Please welcome the chairman of the Minor Planets Department at the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics in Cambridge, Massachusetts, Dr. Harold Lefkin. Thanks for being with us, uh, Dr. Lefkin. Let me just ask you point blank, should we be concerned? Uh, it's really too early to tell, so I don't think so. Okay. Is there a chance this asteroid could hit Earth? Uh, there are many scenarios, one of which happens to be a direct impact with Earth. We predict sometime in the year 2019. Okay. If it is going to hit Earth, what can we, what can we, the people of Earth, do to stop it? In my opinion, I think our best bet would be uh, to drill a hole in the asteroid, plant a small nuclear device somewhere in the middle, and uh, blow it up from within. So. You can, you can really do that? I mean, science can do that? Yes, we can do that, but before we did that, the first step would be, I would say we have to assemble a ragtag group of irreverent oil riggers, <laughs> have them land a spacecraft on the asteroid, and plant the explosive. Oil riggers? That's right. Now, we already have, we've got the grizzled veteran. This guy's, this guy's years of hard work have rendered him too old for the... Um, we've got the borderline, psychotic, sardonic geek. We've got the handsome young buck, you know, and this guy's sexual, his sexual relations with the grizzled veteran's daughter, that's going to provide an intriguing source of conflict. All right. Uh, Dr. Lefkin, you just described the exact plot and characters from the movie Armageddon. <laughs> you think my motley crew of lovable roughnecks has the wrong stuff, don't you? Okay, that was a great joke in the movie. That joke was in the movie. It sounds to me like you don't really know anything about asteroids. Maybe not. But I do know this. If Bruce Willis fails, that asteroid will slam into Earth. It's going to wipe out civilization as we know it. It's going to blanket the planet under a layer of ash nearly as high as the Statue of Liberty. Uh-huh. This, of course, is going to provide ideal conditions for the ascension of a new master race of super-intelligent talking apes. So, Doctor, you're talking about a planet of the apes? Yes, I suppose it would be a planet of the apes. They would probably give each other names like Mr. Zaius. Okay. <laughs> Don't you mean Dr. Zaius? I suppose if they went to college, some of them could become doctors. Okay, you're an idiot. That's we enough. Don't know that We're going to take a break. It's, it's a total to waste of everyone's time. No, it's, it's not, not hard waste. to tell. We'll be right People back. Be Andy Killer. That was a waste of time. Thank you.